everyone, my name is Serena. And I'm Chloe. And today, we are going to meet someone very special. We are so happy to be meeting someone that we admire, Tun Dr. Mahathir Mohamad, our beloved Prime Minister. And together, we are going to learn how to code. I'm excited. I can't wait. Let's go. Hello, Tun. My name is Serena and I'm 10 years old. I have a social enterprise called Serena Secret where I provide job opportunities for the autistic adolescents and all the funds will be given to the younger children for therapy and therapy equipment. Good morning, Tun. I am Chloe. I build robots. First, I started out with building robot animals. Now, I build robots to help farmers. Hi. The two of you, well, you are very young <laughs> compared to me. I'm 93 only. So I'm Mahadir, Prime Minister of Malaysia. Glad to meet you. We do what we do because of, we believe in STEM. STEM stands for Science, Technology, Engineering and Mathematics. And that is what we do to make a difference. Tun, we hope that you have used the HoloLens to view an augmented reality hut. That was really cool. Yeah, I did uh, try to use it. It's fantastic. You can see the inside of the hut and you can see everything that uh, the hut normally looks like. STEM can be used and it doesn't matter what age or what ability or what background you are. You can use it when you're in school and you can use it as adults. As we embrace STEM, coding is the language of how we program things. Tun, are you ready to code? Well, uh, I want to learn from you. At the beginning of each level, there is um, a goal. Do you want to try? So first, we have to move forward twice. So if I put one. already shared one sheet. Just drag it and bring it connected. And back. Digital skills and STEM education are not limited to our classrooms. Coding is the language of the future and lifelong learning is critical in ensuring we remain relevant as transformation occurs across geographies and industries, healthcare, manufacturing, transportation. As part of today's digital world, all of us have the responsibility to learn, unlearn and relearn as we work to become a digital nation, digital by default, transformational and secure by design. As Malaysia continues uh, its digital transformation journey, technology plays an important role. Mobility, cloud computing, the Internet of Things, artificial intelligence or AI, and big data analytics are among the most important drivers of digital transformation. With the STEM, science, technology, engineering and mathematics needs to be democratized in order to develop future-ready Malaysian talent. We all can code. Even if we are 93 years old, we can code and use it for the progress of this country. Or we are still in school, thinking about what we want to be when we grow up. Coding allows us to not just be users of technology, but creators of technology. Let's, Let's work, work together, together towards, towards Digital, digital Malaysia. Malaysia. Tun, what is your vision for the class of 2030? Well, in 2030, you and your friend here will be much more older and you will be 
playing a role in the politics and the development of this country. What is your wise advice for being a Prime Minister? Well, when you are a Prime Minister, you must always care for the people and the country and not think only about yourself. <laughs>